Hello everyone, are you preparing for your MBBS entrance examination? If yes, you are in the right place. I am Saroz, an intern doctor at TU Teaching Hospital, Kathmandu. While I am saying this, I remember my entrance preparation time. I did my plus two from St. Xavier's College, Maitigar, and I started preparing for my MBBS entrance after I entered 12th grade by joining a pre-medical session in an entrance institute in Kathmandu. And fortunately, I got a scholarship seat in IOM as a fresher. Anyone who gets selected here at IOM will tell you that their entrance preparation journey was not that difficult and it holds true in my case too. Let me tell you one thing first. Entrance preparation is all about your motivation of becoming a doctor and your dedication to do anything to achieve your goal. If you are preparing for MBS entrance examination, you will fall in one of the three group of students that I will mention. Group 1. You are not motivated at all for the entrance. However, you are trying to attempt it once, just believing in your luck. If that is the case, let me make you very clear that it will be nearly impossible for you to get it in IOM. I am not trying to demotivate you, but this is the reality that you need to understand. Group 2. You are highly motivated and dedicated towards your goal. You are studying hard for it. Believe me, nothing and no one can stop you from becoming a doctor. Group 3. You want to become a doctor. You are studying for it, but at times you feel lazy, you get frustrated, but you have one thing in common that I had, and that is a strong desire to become a doctor. Let me tell you, this happens to everyone. When I was preparing for my entrance examination, there were several thoughts going on in my mind. To overcome it, I made a simple formula that helped me to secure a seat in IOM. And today, I will be sharing that simple formula with you all. And my formula was my schedule. I made a schedule that had just three things. Eat, sleep, study. That's all I did during my entrance preparation. You see, studying is all that you can do. So, either I slept, or I ate, or I studied. Nothing more, nothing less. I told myself that scrolling Facebook, gathering with friends, visiting Paspatinath, and all other things can still happen after my examination. The only thing that I considered important was studying, and I just studied. This schedule may sound impractical, but trust me, I have done it and you can do it as well. Okay, tell me one thing. What is stopping you from studying? Whatever it is, put it on side. Is that your mobile phone? Just switch it off. Is it your friend who is asking you to go out and chill and do time pass? Then my friend, this is the time you constrict your friend circle. Or is it you yourself who, is, who don't like to study? If that is the case, then please tell your that self that you are not going to be a doctor any soon. Or motivate yourself that you need to do this. You need to study. You need to study hard. You need to be a doctor. You need to make your parents proud. You need to do something for your people, for your country. On top of it, you need to do this to live your dream life as a doctor. If you want to wear a white coat and a stethoscope like me, you need to focus on your preparation like I did. Finally, to tell you about the resources that I used, um, I attended coaching classes and studied their modules and their notes and uh, took many tests. These days, you can take multiple tests online, sitting in your home. And that is awesome. IOM and IOE entrance preparation page on Facebook could be your next platform where you can take online exams regularly. Thank you for listening to me. Stay motivated and keep preparing.